Uh, hello there people and good morning. Uh, this is Mr. Critic and you're watching my LP of Answer General. So, um, this is probably the last part of Middle East, uh, part 5, I think. Uh, yeah. Let us see the map. Basically, this is what is left of the Allied resistance. And of course, mm, since there are many non victory objectives, it is possible uh, for the enemy to have purchased, you know, some, I don't know, anti tanks, inf something cheap inside the non victory objectives. But Baghdad is what matters. Once we are done here, the battle is over. I was watching a lot of Half-Life uh, 2 lately, all episodes and everything on YouTube. I was just thinking how funny it would be, you know, we are finally in Baghdad, think we have won and some <laughs> somebody else, STRIDER, <laughs> you know, or something, or, <laughs> or even crazier thing. Uh, we have heard commu overheard the Allied communication. They're talking about a squadron of Abrams. I think there are some sort of tanks, but nothing to worry about, you know, <laughs> something like, <laughs> and then, you know what I mean, uh, some really advanced weapon appears in World War II, <laughs> then <laughs> we are screwed. <laughs> but okay, I have these crazy ideas, I apologize. So, um, okay, we'll start by moving all of the naval units. They are patrolling, you know, in an important job, and these two, and you know, the things that are boring but necessary. Although perhaps we can find some use for these fighters here, scouting. Yeah, they have 60 of fuel, why not? Let them scout since we will be advancing towards, you know, non-victory objectives and they could prove useful. So you go here and you go here. Uh, elite for this tank. We will not move it anymore since, you know, at least not in the video, in the off-screen part, maybe. And one Bridge engineer unit w will advance towards the city and the airfield uh, at An Najaf, and the other one here to the city of. <laughs> I thought it was the city of Swamp. <laughs> Sorry, city of Karbala. But for the time being, they can stay together since they're going in the same general direction. Also, here we have reached some airfields and. One unit will go here, it will remain protected by a fighter just in case. The other two, I have thought a lot about it, but you know, uh, if the enemy purchases, I don't know, a fighter, it has um, spotting of three, so if it, if it is purchased here, then you know, uh, one, two, three, four, and here we should be safe. Yet, still close enough, you know, to fly over the airfields on the next turn. And then, you know, disembark if possible. Uh, yeah, also, this unit needs fuel desperately, so we'll retreat it. Uh, however, these two can fly ahead and assist in taking non-victory objectives, you know, should there be any resistance. I will not no longer, you know, protect um, all of the uh, air units, especially those that are way out of spotting range of possible, you know, enemy uh, aircraft. But I don't think we'll see uh, any more enemy aircraft. It is too late in the game, and the AI will have other priorities. Ah, okay, elite also here. Oh. You fly and scout. You just follow him. And 
anything else that is just you know uh, boring and doesn't deserve any special attention no I think this is it so now we'll save and get serious about it uh, middle 0 31 mm. and now we are here first we we'll level bump um, the air defense near Baghdad He's extremely lucky, but I think now it, it is also out of ammo. So let us probably, I don't know, fly here to remain in the area, but you know, not to provoke anything. Uh, yeah, out of ammo. This is a good quality of level bombers. Not only they suppress, you know, they destroy ammo, and the more experienced they are, the more ammo and fuel they destroy uh, with each attack okay now now we can actually get some more experience for our uh, rookie tactical bomber I believe now we'll have one star if we're lucky and it will no, no longer be a rookie no close but not close enough this fighter we will retreat uh, maybe here yeah o or maybe I'm not sure where are the airfields we'll have some soon here in the south but others are way back Yeah, I guess I will not bother you with this, you know, attack and move away. Excellent. Just fly back. We'll find you an airfield sooner or later. Uh, now, this tactical bomber here can only reach uh, the anti-tank gun, so our elite tactical bomber will move away without attacking but first we'll try to deal with the Reckon and fly south huh. and fly south so now we'll be able to see if anything is hiding here. Ah, I was, you know, I was looking for airplanes, but now we see that we have an inf and an anti tank gun. Is there any airfield that we do not see at the moment? Uh, no? Okay, then now it's official. No more IRAF. Excellent. So we can, we can, you know, do whatever we want, uh, and do not worry about uh, possible repercussions. And this means we will attack this inf with our uh, rookie fighter. Try to get some experience. Very nice. Always good to attack units on the river hex with fighters since you know uh, their defenses drop I believe uh, to one half they usually have I think so somebody knows for sure please uh, comment and uh, just you know uh <laughs> to be absolutely sure now we'll destroy this uh, air defense without ammo excellent Are there any units nearby that need experience? Yeah, this one, of course. Good. Uh, and only elite remaining, so we'll use them. You 
think you will attack this tank. Very nice. Uh, let's do more fighters. Uh, yeah. Two more fighters. So you can finish off this tank. Or maybe, no, we'll attack actually the, this wagon. Actually a very good quality reckon, as you can see we've been attacking it for quite a while and it's still... Oh, and hard attack of 9. Probably excellent against transports. But instead of attacking this imp, we'll finish off the, bi the bigger threat, you know, so bye bye tank. And now we'll advance. I was thinking about bringing um, the Italian Reckon here, however, you know, there are two infantry nearby and this is not a very good unit, so why risk it and lose a unit, you know, in the last video? I will just move auxiliaries out of the way, you know, since now uh, uh, the battle is basically over and they, you know, they're just bothering us. So we, they impede our movement. Now that's a big word, isn't it? <laughs> okay, let us advance. Ah, you are out. Advance. Advance, advance, you need fuel and you can advance. And you can also be refueled. Ah. This tank is lagging behind, but it has four stars of experience, so you know, it is good. Uh, now well, we do not need to save it I think weather uh, we give the enemy its turn and then we save and take a little pause X is turn 10 nothing happened on the allied turn so now we save even though I do not think it is really necessary to study the battlefield but you know it's an old habit so I'll be right back uh, yeah, I'm back. Uh, in the end, it really wasn't such a bad idea to study the battlefield, uh, battlefield after all, since I have completely forgot about one non-victory objective, uh, the city of Al Kuwait, um, which cannot be, you know, taken by, um, no, by, <laughs> by air transports. I mean, uh, since uh, there is no airfield nearby, so have decided to divert uh, these bridge engineers and send them towards the city of Al Kuwait instead since you know uh, we will be able to use our Italian units uh, for the city of Al Najaf and as you can see the enemy has reacted responded to our presence here and purchased two anti-tanks light ones but still you know and now we have an airfield which is good uh, yeah what to do with the remaining units here uh, we have a tactical bomber that will use to attack this anti-tank gun Wow, 
perfect result and an infantry well now I'm not sure I was planning to send the more experienced infantry here to deal with the anti-tank but now there is no more anti-tank so I guess this rookies will do but we need to protect them or do we actually well after huh now I would be extremely surprised you know if now suddenly there were airplanes in the area but we need to play it safe I think so uh, who are you ah, okay you yeah okay you can fly here and scout An infantry but no airplanes so Italians here uh, what else do we have to attack we have this fighter anything else ah tactical bomber that can actually reach this inf okay so we'll use a tactical bomber yeah and on the next turn uh, this inf will be gone as well okay so we still have to check uh, no airfields here we still have to check uh, this airfield but this will be done shortly so and we have another airfield and now we are sure right yeah okay now we are sure we do not have to protect this two uh, so I guess we can start working on other enemy units you are not in range too bad so we'll use our elite fighter for the job Good. Uh, where can you assist? You can scout here, but you also need experience, so I'll send you north, I think. Just first we check for our tactical bombers. The rookie ones still cannot reach anything, so we'll just bring them closer. You are flying west in search of an empty airfield ah you were destroying um, this anti-tank gun so please continue <laughs> perfect you can fly here to the fuel and now we'll do a trick Four, five, six. and take over a non-victory objective immediately yeah I just love bridge engineers you know especially <laughs> since they can perform you no know, such miracles okay uh, Italian fighters you can fly closer and you can scout for us since there is probably somebody also in this city anti-tank gun yeah very nice a fighter 
Okay, destroy this tank. Good. Now we'll bomb this artillery again. And now we have one star of experience and it is time to give our strength to our no longer rookie tactical bomber. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, who are you? Ah, level bomber. So we can start working on the heavy weapons infantry. More experience for our rookie fighter. What a crappy result. Okay. And perhaps more experience for you. You see? You see, Rookie? This is the way to do it. Any more airplanes in the area? Yeah. You can start working on this anti-tank. Or maybe... No, I'm not sure. Oh, uh, no. We can leave it be. We'll bring our bridge engineers close soon. So for the time being... Or maybe... I'm so bad in deciding, you know. Okay, attack it. Lower its entrenchments. Do some damage if possible. Okay, no damage. Perhaps better luck next time. Uh, we'll attack this inf which is closest to um, our uh, Italian Reckon. Very nice. And now we'll also destroy this artillery. Good, so now our Reckon is safe, not in range of anything dangerous. We bring our bridge engineers closer, the same goes for our tanks. And now you can follow if you want. Come on, tanky, tanky. The battle will be over before you arrive. Oh, uh, this tank. Now I think we do not need it. Um, you know, I was planning first to actually to replace the bridge engineers that are going south to use a tank for this objective and this bridge engineers for this objective but I completely forgot about um, the infantry in the transport so now we can just give over strength power to our tank and we can bring another fighter closer or maybe send it way south yeah we are lacking airplanes in the south so you know if somebody is hiding inside we'll assist uh, our bridge engineers okay elite for you and the last now now this is this is the maximum for the unit five stars of experience uh, 15 strength so now this is 
an uber super elite, you know. <laughs> Unit. <coughs> now we move the units. Give elite to our tactical bomber, and this is it. Oh no, it's not it actually. Now we have another air transport, so you can join the fray. <laughs> Abandon truck and fly. Eastish. <laughs> <You know? laughs> no particular. No particular direction, you know. Um, in you know what I mean. Uh, we'll decide afterwards where to send it, if to send it. Middle 033. Why did I save this now? I'm an idiot. Uh, weather, fair dry. Okay. Enemy's turn. X is turn 11. 16 turns remaining. New equipment available, but the existing tanks are better than this one, so... We'll not bother with it. Let us save. We'll use the same slot. Again, time for a little pause to study the battlefield. It proved useful in the previous turn, so be right back. Okay, mm, done. Now we just move the naval units first to, you know, do the boring part first, but necessary. <laughs> Otherwise, you know, I wouldn't sleep well. Also, we bring uh, our fighter here to get to full strength. And this is it. Okay, as for the battlefield. <coughs> uh, this is now the situation. Here in the south, we will try to take over some more objectives with our Italian units, but way to the south, um, we are still advancing towards the city of Al Kuwait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Almost out of fuel. And you really do not want to resupply in a desert. And our fighter is following us. Oh, I'm so sorry. I need a little pause. Be right back. Uh, sorry again. I am suffering the consequences of being out late last night, you know. Uh, but it is better now. So, ah, where were we? Here. Okay. Uh, now we'll strafe um, the anti-tank gun and then fly south to scout. Uh, since you know our bridge engineers will soon reach uh, the city of Al Kuwait and if there is something inside we need to start working on its defenses. Okay, what is this? An anti-tank gun, expected. And now with some luck we'll wipe out uh, this anti-tank gun and take over another objective with, with our Italian infantry. Excellent. Basra is ours. And most likely the next turn. Uh, did I mention that uh, I want to do two more uh, since they are short? Uh, in the next turn I will give some transport to this infantry. So it will be quicker uh, about taking Abadan and Ahvas. Okay, but here we just land and here as well. Uh, what have we here? Okay, another air transport. I don't know, fly east. You can start crossing the desert if you feel like it. Yeah. You get elite. And this tactical bomber will also 
Start flying across the desert. Uh, yeah, here we have more units. You are elite now, so can you can fly here. A byproduct, you know. Now we see uh, that also the non-victory objective of Abaddon is occupied, but we'll take care of it. So perhaps it is best to send our tactical bomber south. M of 2 should suffice for what I have in mind for this tactical bomber and also fuel of 35 will be enough mm. okay now we strafe this anti-tank gun Very good. And we also fly south since here we have way too much, uh, too many, sorry, units to, to deal with what is left of the defenses around Baghdad. But here we will get, you know, probably some more kills and more experience for our fighter. And now a question remains what happens if we attack head on? Uh, shit will happen, so um, we'll attack with our tactical bomber first. Very nice. Close to five stars of experience, and we take over the non victory objective of Karbala. Okay. Now we have to start worrying about getting more experience for our inexperienced units. So first we'll level bomb this heavy weapons infantry. Also fly south. Entrenchment of seven. I see. Okay, you deal with this inf. By the way, uh, where did uh, that reckon go that we were attacking? It's probably hiding somewhere here in the desert, but it will show up eventually. You need a lead. Okay. One um, better way. You see here uh, up left movement cost of seven. This means that this is the maximum since we know the transport has uh, a range of seven. So instead of counting all the time, sometimes you can watch, uh, you know, Take a look at the screen and see. So, yeah. We'll attack the heavy weapons infantry. As I do not dare you know to attack it with our uh, rookie tactical bombers. Holy shit. And it's gone. Okay, now we have more targets. <laughs> well, I mean less targets than we have units, so perhaps we should find uh, that bloody reckon. Where to start? Here maybe? No? 
Okay, we have more. Um, so let us go here. Ah, now we have it. Ah, here you are. Come, come to Papa. So I can kill you. Elite. Uh, okay, a job for you. Now probably five stars of experience after it. Excellent result. Yeah, five stars. Perfect. Uh, two more tactical bombers. You will attack this inf. I'm not happy about it. I'm just, you know, <laughs> looking for a rugged defense. Probably, but you know. Come on. Yes. Force it to retreat. Come on. Ah. Bastard. But good for experience, nonetheless. So, uh, six, seven. Okay, so we'll attack again. Firing at the same time. Retreat, you punk. Excellent. And we take over the city of Al Kazimaya. Sorry if my pronu pronunciation is bad. Okay. Tanks will now advance as well. Wait for me! Perhaps it is time to save, if anything goes wrong. Middle 034. Okay, another tactical bomber. You can start working on this inf. Good for experience if you actually do some damage. Very nice. 90 experience, very close to one star and we only have two fighters remaining so let us send them where? south probably, yeah ok time to save the game Middle zero thirty-five. Ah, again I saved too early. Okay, casualties. It's been a while. And Axis turn twelve. Fifteen turns remaining. Now we save. Mm. 35 and this time no studying of the battlefield oh I reckon he's trying to escape but you know we will not allow it you fly here ah here you are perfect oh, what else Okay, the obvious, the obvious. And I think you will not hold it against me if we now take a sneak peek, you know, of what is remaining since uh, 
since I'm curious and you are probably also so okay you advance you too okay first we'll deal with the inf Okay, bridge engineers, it's your turn. Wait a second. Now I'll do something stupid, but you know, uh, I don't want to do another turn. So, I'll lower its entrenchments by sacrificing, not really sacrificing, but you know, uh, some damage will be done to our um, Reckon. Very likely. Mm. Yeah. Okay, this doesn't count. Okay, we'll save it because I want to finish this now. And um, middle 036. This doesn't count. Uh, this is only for fun. And now, bridge engineers. Uh, I will have to load the game. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> really sorry. Uh, uh, 0 036. Uh, sneak peek. Uh, Okay. Ah, this is it. Yeah. Okay. No more sneak peek. Uh, now uh, we'll use our better engineers just to finish it, you know. Yeah, and this worked. And our tactical bomber will attack this Reckon for even more experience. Good. So, my friends, this is it. Uh, now we just take over uh, the objectives. Uh, especially Baghdad and what is left for us is off screening or perhaps we can also attack here huh just for fun okay nah nah, nah why Okay, the battle is over, uh, we take over Baghdad, and this is Axis major victory. Reviewing the battlefield, well, you've seen it already, so no point. Let us end, confirm end, okay, Axis major victory, we will not save the game since, you know, uh, I'm planning to lose uh, this scenario so we can get to El Alamein, but what happens after a major victory? Uh, so yeah, great triumph in the Middle East, been acclaimed by all Germany. So strategically we are in an excellent position on the Western Front. 
we can either go to England, so Sea Lion 43. Mm, what? Uh, ah, we have increased the size of our navy. And uh, Sea Lion 43 is basically the same as uh, Sea Lion 41. Uh, is it 1 or 40? Oh my god, uh, my history lessons didn't pay off. I think I think it was in... No. Uh, now you got me confused. It's your fault. Uh, but uh, whatever. Uh, but this is interesting one, uh, Caucasus. Now we actually get to Stalingrad, but from the southern front. Um, so in the rare occasions that I actually went to North Africa, I have chosen then um, this scenario. And here, you know, you deploy your troops here in the south and advance north, taking over the objectives, you know, in the south. And you have plenty of auxiliary units, which are kind of good, but nothing special. Uh, to you know to advance a little bit and then you join here and take over Stalingrad. Uh, it is actually a very easy scenario. Well, most of them are. <laughs> so okay. Uh, yeah. What else? I think now you get Tiger tanks. No. No. Uh, actually, you get Tiger tanks uh, during uh, this scenario. Uh, but you have them for uh, Moscow for. Yeah, you 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 definitely have them for Moscow 42. Yeah, uh, this I know for sure. Of course, if you get them. <laughs> Sorry, I'm an idiot. Uh, anyway, so a lot of off-screening. Uh, we will intentionally lose um, the scenario of uh, Middle East and then go to El Alamein. Uh, thank you for watching this. Uh, all the best from Mr. Critic and bye bye.